Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Florida Carbuff. And in today's episode, we're gonna be taking a look and going into full detail and reviewing the brand new released 118 scale Kyosho BMW E92 M3 Coupe Black Special with M Kidney plus suitcase. And, um, and yeah guys, just as the name implies, this item brings this really, really cool suitcase that we can see right here. Really, really dope item, you know. It's actually very limited. I believe it's uh, one out of 99 pieces were ever made. And um, a lot of detail. Like I said, it comes with this M3 suitcase that comes in the trunk has a black on black wheels if you guys watch right there lovely detail here we have some of the interior from the passenger side and you know it has you could say black simulated interior very very pristine um, model we'll take a look at the driver's side now you know of course, we got traditional Kyosho quality, which it means, you know, carpet, no doggy hinges, you know, discreet, realistic looking door hinges, you know, a lot of details. Kyosho never, never fails. When it comes to interiors, you know, outside from a couple specific models, I would even opinionate that Kyosho makes better interiors interiors than Auto Arm. But that's also dependent on the model too, so. But yeah guys, should we take a look at the car now? Just kind of like sideways, giving you guys different different type of, of visuals so you guys can get an idea what the paint is like when it's super bright flash versus medium flash. Things of that nature. Um, here we got the wheel very nice uh, uh uh break this ceramically painted you know then brake calipers are pretty much just painted black to match um here we have the m kidney as a as it's called and that's really just this three stripes right here on the grill and that's what makes this model right here special and unique like i said it's actually only a hundred of these pieces out there and um it was such a mission for me to even just get my minds because even as I was about to buy one when it was a quantity of five, some reseller, not even a buyer or a collector, no, this is literally resellers, pretty much bought the five that were in quantity right when I was buying that one. So then I had to do even more of a search. I had to go into even more of a search to then finally localize one, which I eventually did. So these have completely sold out extremely super fast. I don't know if it's because of the black on black thing, but I probably understand that because like I said, I'm a fanatic of that type of spec on many different vehicles and die cast car models. But anyway guys, here we have uh here we have the BMW M3 coupe. Here we can take a little bit of a look at the motor. In, in chrome colored letters you know not chrome colored letters but you know it has you know uh, uh, hints of the of the color stripes the same ones you see on the grill it has them where it says m3 right right there at the top of the of the motor so yeah guys here we have the model right now basically we're trying to get a different you know a different lighting type of vibe so we took the model down to my uh my parking garage diorama let's take a better look at the wheels right here which is more close up and more detail if you guys want to take a look i mean really nice really love how they have the bmw logo 
right onto the center hubcap. It looks super crispy and super detailed. Like, the paint looks marvelous. I honestly prefer uh, shooting this model with medium flash rather than full blown flash because then you can kind of really appreciate just the the tone of and just the meanness of of this of this version of this. I think it's called Midnight Black. Is the is the actual paint color of this one? I don't think it's a metallic black. But another thing I want you guys to take note of is the rooftop. Notice the pattern on the rooftop. It seems to be like some kind of carbon fiber type of looking rooftop. Although this would be, I don't know if this is nano fiber. But again, it's, I will have to actually refer back to the real car to find out exactly what that is. Nonetheless, just ex exquisitely represented by Kyosho on this one. And yeah guys, um, so we pretty much have looked at the trunk, we've looked at the interior, we've looked at the wheels, we've looked at the lights, we looked at the front, I mean we'll look at the back lights a little bit more. And um and yeah guys like I said I highly highly recommend this model if you happen to get your hands in one because like I said this model is already sold out and super you know it's become extremely hard just to even buy it for any price period I believe you might see some of these back on eBay probably at least four to five hundred dollars by the way I bought mine for just a hundred dollars so all right guys that's gonna do it for this one hope you guys enjoyed the video do make sure to slap a like and subscribe to the channel for more content like this. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. And with that one, I'm outie guys. Peace.